Hello and welcome to my Yu-Gi-Oh! channel. Make sure to subscribe for more daily Yu-Gi-Oh! content. Today we've got a brand new card which has been introduced within Yu-Gi-Oh! 7s. It's called the Indomitable Post-Apocalyptic Beast Warrior. It's a normal spell card with the requirement. If you control a face-up, the Post-Apocalyptic Beast Gear World, you can pay 1000 life points. And the effect is to choose one monster, it must be a Beast Warrior type, in your graveyard and special summon it face-up. During this turn, the attacks of the special summoned monster pierce. So what this card does is it lets you go back into your post-apocalyptic archetype. Most of those novices are Beast Warrior anyway, so it supports the archetype and it's an archetypal based card anyway. The cost is a lot, a thousand life points considering you're reviving a Beast Warrior monster and it has the ability to do piercing for a turn. Depending on what you can bring back, it can then probably use its own effect as well. So that's one benefit of it. It doesn't have any negations or restrictions. It doesn't have to remain in defense. It doesn't have any ability to be the only monster that has to attack. But do I think it's going to be that useful? No, it's probably something that's going to be forgotten. The artwork is nice, but other than that, it's very easy to forget this card. 